Mm, very good morning my dear students so in this uh, ppt i am going to explain you torque tube drive okay so already we uh, studied about the hotkeys uh, drive so the both are same uh, power transmission only but here uh, something uh, parts are uh, different okay so here uh, normally this uh, uh, torque tube drive is uh, in this type of uh, Mm, torque drive, uh, torque tube drive. The spring takes the body weight and the side thrust uh, only. Okay. So here the torque reaction and the driving thrust are taken by the another uh, uh, member called as a torque. Uh, this torque bar okay now that is the main difference between these two okay so the drive on system is generally used in passenger car heavy commercial vehicles this is also used in both cars and heavy commercial vehicles so uh, in the figure i mentioned all the parts that is a it is using a laminated springs which are connected to the frame by swinging shackle at the each end and a tab and a tubular member called as a torque tube so here tubes are used instead of universal joint but here universal joint also used okay and it will encloses the propeller shaft and it is bolted directly to the axle casing so the torque tube is positioned out with the change or that is fixed at the front by a ball and a socket joint which is located at the rear of the gearbox and that is a cross member of the frame okay a small diameter uh, propeller shaft is installed inside the torque tube so uh, and spring to the final drive pinion okay so there is a small diameter propeller shaft is fixed uh, to install in the uh, torque tube so that uh, the Final uh, that is a final type of pinion can be uh, to rotate okay and a universal joint is installed in the center of the ball joint to allow the angular deflection of the drive so by using this universal joint it will turn or it will rotate uh, it will deflect the drive okay so uh, the design problem that the torque tube is uh, solved is how to get the traction force generated by the wheels to the car frame okay the torque tube is transmitted the uh, transmit the force by directly coupling the axle differential to the transmission and therefore the propellers uh, the car forwarded by pushing on the engine and then through the engine mount on the car frame okay so this is about the working of this torque tube so i will repeat this the main function of this torque tube is it will transmit the force by directly coupling the axle differential to the transmission and the uh, transmission because of this the propeller the car forward by pushing on the engine and then uh, through the engine mount the car frame will rotate okay but whereas in the Hotkeys drive it has the traction forces transmitted to the car frame by using the other suspension components such as a leaf spring or trail okay but uh, here uh, the axle differential components are using okay a ball or a socket type of uh, joint called as a torque ball uh, and is used to at one end of the torque tube and to allow the relative motion between the axle and transmission due to the suspension travel so here uh, and uh, not only that and since the torque tube does not constrain the axle in the lateral side that is side to side direction and penard rod is often used for this uh, purpose okay this a uh, rod is used to uh, direct the all the component okay and it is a combination of the penard rod and the torque tube allows the easy implementation of the soft uh, soft coil spring in the rear to give a good uh, ride quality okay so here i told in the um, diagram in the next slide torque tube uh, differs from the hotkeys uh, design in the, that a solid drive shaft is enclosed in a hollow torque tub and rotated within a support bearing to prevent the whipping okay so here this is about the torque tube drive so here just to observe here the only one universal joint is using but whereas in the hotkeys drive we are using two and this mechanism also fixed on the frame also the spring that is a laminated springs are there so here i wrote here in this type of the drive spring it takes only the side thrust beside supporting the weight of the body okay the torque reaction and the driving thrust are taken by a another member which is called as a torque tube so here i told here torque tube okay na? one end of the torque tube is attached to the axle casing another end is which is uh, spherical shape of the fixed uh, in the cup fixed to the frame okay now so in that uh, we are dotted line because it is uh, uh, fixed in the frame uh, the torque tube encloses the propeller shaft since the torque uh, tubes takes a torque reaction at the center line of the bell pinion pinion shaft will not shift okay now last one so that the no sliding joint is required and no universal joint is enough whereas in the hotkeys drive we are using both sliding joint and the universal joint but here we are not using okay so in both the types of the drive shafts are the side thrust is taken to the leaf spring only but a separate member is employed to the overcome this situation it is called as a penard rod okay and it is uh, fixed to parallel to wheel axis with one end of the pivoted to the axle or to the other chassis frame okay so here i shown in the diagram so this is about the torque tube uh, shaft that is a drive okay so 
so that blue that is pink color shows that uh, to this drive shop okay so what are the example of uh, torque tubes in uh, so some cars are using there is an american car for the ford brand up through 1948 which is used in the less expensive transfer spring that could not take the thrust okay due to this they are using this type of uh, tube okay drive tube torque drive tube okay and also it is used in c5 and c6 uh, correlate to correlate to mercedes benz uh, sls uh, amg so these are the names of vehicles okay c5 c6 uh, correlate uh, correlate okay uh, so this is about the uh, torque uh, draft tube okay drive tube so torque tube drive okay uh, so both are uh, used for the transmission of power only but mechanism is different that's it so both questions are very very important uh, uh, but we have to uh, practice more uh, diagram uh, that is this diagram but both uh, diagram that is hotkeys drive and this torque tube drive so looks uh, similar diagram there is a lot of differences there okay so here we are using only universal joint is there that universal joint is connected with what that is a one cup of shape there uh, again there is a gear box okay from the gear box uh, uh, power from the gearbox when engine is started uh, power is generated from in the gear that is in the gearbox that from the gearbox it will transmit to the uh, near to the wheel with the help of this universal joint okay torque tube mm, okay, nah, and and this uh, 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 wheel is uh, hand uh, that is a uh, it like just to observe in the diagram uh, so this wheel is handed in the uh, vehicle okay nah? so this rod is called as torque tube drive okay Mm, and leaf spring is also there here springs or coil springs are there so this is about the spring that is a laminated spring okay uh, this is about the torque tube drive i hope you understand this uh, thank you